Oh, hello there. I don't know what I was doing there, but oh well, never mind. But hello, we're back here with some more Mass Effect 3. Um, well, I'm pretty sure since it, we did a DLC mission, nobody wants to talk, so... Commander? Yeah, I knew it. Yeah, we can just get straight into the action. The, the fun action yumminess. So, so don't you worry about that, all we have to do is just... Well, basically, just do more of the DLC, really. And that's what I want to do. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Okay, yeah, I've got to return to the lab. Return to Dr. Bryson's lab. Oh, dear. Wait, is the mass re... No, okay. The massive relay of my erection. What? I don't know, I'm just waffling bollocks, bollocks, eh, 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 bollocks! I'm really struggling to talk today, sorry. Waffling all sorts of massive bollocks right now. I always like that word, bollocks. It only really sounds, sounds good whenever British people say it, but like whenever I see like Americans or like anyone from other places say it, it, it just doesn't sound right. <laughs> At least not to me. You know, it, it, it's, it's like someone, uh, oh, oh, shit. It's like sometimes some things are better left to the, uh, to the accents of a certain country. Like, say, Australians, they're the best at saying can't. Or something like that, I don't know. And Americans are best at yee-haw, you know. We're all good at something. Oh, I should really shut up right now. We need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. But is it really an ally? I'd call it dangerous as hell. Ryson's assistant tried to kill me. Perhaps Leviathan was controlling him to protect itself, diverting people away from its trail. Maybe. It just shows we don't know what we're dealing with yet. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. Yes, indeed, eh? Let's be. Let's do more Citadel Noir stuff. I, I'm. I'm. I'm gonna be like. I. I. I doubt you as you start making weird faces, weird, overly extravagant faces. But you know, stuff. Ultraviolet emissions. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found nothing. Still, I recommend leaving it shielded. Oh yes, hello. Ah. Very loud. Anything interesting about the artifact's structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance. Okay. Basically, magical bullshit. That's what you're trying to tell me, isn't it, ED? Isn't it? I like magic. Magic's wild cool. Like, whenever I play an RPG or something, I always play as, like, a battle mage. Edie, what oh, project was Garno working on when usual. you found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Oh, my Several God. Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type oh, in the dear. galaxy of fantasy video game. It possesses a gaze attack capable oh, this of triggering really synced animation me. kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. Uh, I meant the project, Edie. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh. Then... No. All right. There's got to be something here on this artifact. Shut up already! What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped off <laughs> the server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. I, I was saying that to the dogs and, and, and Edie and Shepard talking. It's like, I want, I want to just sort of go and do something, but you keep chatting shit and they keep barking and it's just like, oh my god, just stop. 
I, I, I do get extremely, um... I do become extremely irritable sometimes. I don't like it, but... Oh, that's just the way I am, isn't it? Nothing much can really help with that. I'm usually very patient, though. And, and I am really patient, but like little things, like little things annoy the shit out of me. Oh, look. A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. I'm at the dig site in the Pylos Nebula. Project Scarra paid off. I've got another artifact like the one Garneau found. I think it could be affecting people's behavior. You need to shield the one in your office. I tried to warn Garneau, but I can't get through. We've got Reaper scouts coming in toward the main site. I'm heading to the secondary base to grab what research I can. Anne Bryson was attempting to contact Garno on the asteroid colony. She seems to know something about the artifact. Well, she's in trouble. She sounded worried. If Reaper forces were approaching, her concern was warranted. Let's hope we get to her before they do. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Also, this session today is probably going to be one that's extremely loud, like the last one. Just noises upon noises upon noises, as usual. The Reapers. Let's hope we find Anne before they do. Yeah, let's hope. Whoa. Can you identify this, Edie? It originates with a pre-spaceflight culture, but there are none recorded in the Pylos Nebula. Yeah, that is weird. Look at that. It's like a Reaper statue thingy. Painting, actually, not a statue, you fucking idiot. Well, I'm sorry. Gosh, I'm just like I'm just like a complete knob today. Does anything in Anne Bryson's work history suggest where she might be? Nothing relevant. Boom. You're not relevant, Edie. No, yes you are. PDA. Oh, all the Anne Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. And also, Icarus. It's like that one ship in Strafe. Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. Okay, what about Scope? Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. Okay. Requisitions Locker. I can investigate that. Oh, pardon me. Yoink. There are specifications for several ships here. We need to find the Icarus. Yeah, what about this one, though? Which ship am I looking for again? Ah. The Icarus. There he is. No, I want to look at that one. We are looking for the Icarus. I don't care, I want to have a look at these. The Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system. Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay, we can rule out the relay system. Yeah. Rule that shit out, mate. But let's do some more investigation stuff. The locker is secure. We must locate an access card to open it. Where the hell were you running off to, though? I was very confuzzled. What about criminal activity in the Pylos Nebula? Because the area is part of the Attican Traverse, criminal reports are unreliable at best. And you keep running off somewhere else, I don't know what's up with you. Your pathing seems to be a little bit screwed up right now. Stuff. Access card for the requisitions locker? Yes. Yeah. According to records, it was last used by Anne Bryson to obtain equipment for Project Scarab. Okay. <laughs> ah! Idiot. <laughs> Bryson's assistant Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. But oh, the miners dear. recovered when the artifact was destroyed. Hadley lost consciousness when he attempted to answer our questions about Leviathan. It may have been a deliberate attempt to silence him permanently. Oh dear. I, I, I want to have a look at this. We found Prothean data earlier. Are there any ruins in the Pylos Nebula? 
Nothing Prothean. Oh shit. That's a little bit tragic. Uh ship's max. Based uh, on the uh, search data, it is one of these two systems. But isn't there anything I'm pretty sure there is something else we could use to narrow the search down. Because I know I bloody oh yeah. The Let's see what Ian Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Uh, oh my. I want to steal that. Missing equipment. Water recycling equipment. Equipment. <laughs> Didn't take breathing masks. Based on what Ann Bryson did or did not requisition, the dig site was arid but habitable. Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. Yeah. And then a boshki. Okay. Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Ann Bryson. Damn right. Yeah, that, that, that was a, a much smaller investigation session than last time, wasn't it? No, I didn't want to go to D1. No, I'm a complete idiot. Did not want to go there, but whatever. I can't cancel my choice now. I just have to sit here and wait. And then go back to the thingy, and then loading screen. Yay. And then, and, 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 and then actually go and take it back to the fucking Normandy, mate. So I'm just a little, I'm a little uh, irritated by that. And uh, the loading screen loves to take its time right now. That's really pleasant. I'm really sorry about the noise in the background uh, today. Or just lately in general. It's uh, kind of a bit pissing me off a little bit, but whatever. And stuff like that. You know what I should do though? Check back on the footage. Uh, my boy. Or girl, I don't know. Whichever you are. Well, it seems perfectly fine to me. It just, uh, I just sound extremely lispy uh, more than usual. Because, you know, I've got a lisp. So you're just going to have to deal with it, I'm afraid. No, don't do that. People always tell me not, not to make noises like that because it's not cute. I mean, I, I mean, I, I wouldn't say I'm cute, so. See, he jokes on you, I guess. A uh, bam. Pylos Nebula. Piles Nebula. I wish I could skip these. They, they, they just take a little bit too long for my liking. Zaharin. Let's go over there. Dorada, Narif. You're a fucking Narif. I don't even know what that is. Sounds funny though, so that, that that's pretty good. Uh, whoa. Signal confirmed. Hell yeah. An arid but habitable. Pl <coughs> fucking hell. An arid but habitable planet. Namakli, Earth, was briefly colonised by the Pyrena Corporation, a consortium of Asari colonists and socialised Vulture labourers. After an economic turndown, however, many Asari left the planet and the Vulture population kept growing to the point where they bred faster than could be educated. Soon they turned violent and uncontrollable and the colonies itself self-destructed. Uh, today, Namakli is a wasteland with little population but Vulture packs scattered across the deserts. Settlers frequently run into these packs, discouraging recolonization. The lack of complex biota and scarcity of profitable uh, metals drove the last few proverbial nails into Namakli's coffin. No one has stepped forth in the past in the past few years with the will, the funding, or the firepower to establish a permanent colony. Well then, oh no, wait, I don't think this is. Oh. Gotta bloody spin it around like it's a fucking yo-yo. Oh, whoa. It's going silly. Here we go. Silly to the billy. Whoa. We okay. have located Ann Bryson's dig site. Let's go. I'm gonna go right there. I am. I wonder if we'll find any vulture. I don't think we will, though. Because, uh, the... Oh, why are you being so slow, massive erection? Sorry, I'm getting very irritated by that. I am going to pick Liara. Why not? I'm going to pick all three of those. Two, what? Three? No, two, you fucking knob. 
Sorry. Yeah, it's really taking its time today. I don't know why. Huh. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought the game crashed for a second then. Oh, come on. Why is it being so slow? I mean, it's not, not to do with the heat, is it? I mean, I should, I should probably, like... I mean, one thing I should do is probably... Oh, give me a second. Interruptions as always. Oh my god, I swear I've been sitting here for like five minutes just hoping to... To all bloody hell that like the noises would just stop. And, um... Well, at, at the very least for now that they're uh, bearable. <laughs> so, I can say that. Hey, the plasma shotgun. Uh, I kind of fancy using a bit of the, the Disciple. And I got a 200 thingy, so yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, Liara, you can have a bit of that. And a little bit of that. Garrus, you're pretty okay the way you are. You're the greatest gift I could ever ask for, my baby boy. Uh, can't upgrade you, can't upgrade you, so let's just fuck it. <coughs> Oh, sorry for all the noises. I'm a bit, um, a little bit bunged up and, and got, um, a little bit of a dry throat. Sure, we got oh. reports of an attack on an excavation site. Whoa, did you see that, uh, that stutter bomb? I know I did. Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Uh, it's a leader, I guess. Yes, an attack means we're on the right trail. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional problems. Who knows what we'll find? Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. I really need to dust my microphone. <laughs> we have hostiles! Take us in! Commander, on the landing platform! That's her! Okay, let's get... Damn! Tracking multiple bogeys! Get us over there! Negative, it's too hot. Heading to lower platform. Hang on. There, go. Jump! Give me a second. Oh, okay. There we go. We uh, can't stay here, Shepard. I, I just had to check this something, don't worry. Sight. It's a war zone. Yes, move. it is. She's somewhere above us. Yeah, Hello? move it. Is anyone there? I'm coming down. Move that sweet ass of yours. Gary, Gary baby, give me some of that. Oh, warp ammo, yeah. There you are. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance Navy. It's too dangerous. We'll come to you. Yes, okay. You should take the elevator up on the far side. Copy that. We're on our way. Yeah. I'm most certainly on my way. Whoa, jump edge. Look at all these explosions. Oh, I thought that was like floating, man. Just on nothing. That better not crash down on me. I'd be very upset about that. Oh, hello, Harvester. They're Literally, here. like, fucking space dragons. It's really kind of cool, to be honest. I like it. Sorry if I, if I seem to be talking a little bit less. It's just, um... Like I said, I'm a little bit bunged up and a little bit annoyed today. Commander, they're swarming everywhere up here. Can you find a place Whoa. to hide? I'll try. Get there. Stay put. <laughs> <laughs> you got blown up. How's it feel, nerd? You, you sucker. All you suckers need to die. Yeah. Give me some of that, please. Oh, that's the double barrel shotgun thingy, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure it is. Bam! The Batarian shotgun thingy, Bobby. The Jiggy Wiggy. I don't know. I'm just saying bollocks, really. That's kind of all I do every day. Ah! Look for another path. 
You're most certainly not going up that way. Oi, Garrus, what are you doing? What are you doing, my sexy man? Alright. Eh. Thank you, that's pretty, pretty nice and satisfying. Look at them flying all around the place like they own it. Looks like a bridge over there. Oh, is it? Bridge. Uh, can, can I sprint, please? Thank you. I really appreciate that. Controls are broken. Someone try Whoa. to fix it. Right away. Look at that. Some wires are short. It shouldn't take much to fix it. Give me a second. Oh dear. Boom. Okay, that didn't do fuck all. But I've Got always it. quite liked Ready this shotgun. Got it. I think it's projectile based. This shotgun. It feels like it. Yeah, yeah, come on, are you going to do more twitchy? Haha! -ha. I got ye. Yeah, you can do a bit of that garrison, you can do a little bit of that. Boom, boom. Okay. I want to switch to my other weapon. The arrow can give me a little bit of warp. And then just basically keep shooting it in the head until it dies. A really tough. Wow. I was going to say something, but then I completely forgot what I was going to say. That's what. That was why there was that one, one, uh, one section of really awkward silence. I can be pretty awkward at times, though. I mean, I, I, I'll, I'll wholly admit that. Like sometimes I just say something really dumb, and I'm like, no, 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 okay, just, just shut up, Jamie. <laughs> And, and, and I'm not ashamed to admit that. I will admit that I, I have my little nap ups. Whoa. And the elevator's blocked. <laughs> Is there another way up? I'll override the pod door near you. There's an access point above, Commander, but you'll have to climb to it. Copy that. Someone's talking really loudly in the other room. Like, I don't think it will pick up, but it's very noticeable to me. <laughs> I, I, I get I get a little bit iffy about stuff like that. Uh, do I go through from here? Yes, I do. Whoa. Ah, Reapers. I like Reapers. Reapers are cool. I mean, they're little asshole wankers. But they're just kind of cool, you know. Haha. <laughs> Wobble. They are kind of fat when you think about it. Um... I guess I'll, I'll, uh, yeah, I, I, I guess I'll just sort of snipe these buggers out. Oh, wow, boom. Not even aiming, 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 yeah, whatever. I'm just tired of chatting shit, really. Aiming at me, there we go. I like aiming. I'm struggling to speak, okay. <laughs> Sometimes, whoa! What was that noise? Is there more order around somewhere? Oh no! It's like I heard, I heard like kind of like weird reaper noises, and I was like, whoa! Sexy. Not as sexy as Garrus, obviously, but you know. Who is grunting? Oh, it's a, it's a cannibal. <laughs> yeah, suck it down. No, no, I didn't want that. I did not ask for your covering insolence. I, I I sound like a little bit of a robot today, don't I? Like, hello there. I am Unit Six Two One. For some reason, that reminds me of uh of the the fact I actually watched the uh, Reanimator for the first time the other day. I've always heard it was a great film and. Yeah, it kind of is. <laughs> I, I really, really like that. Commander, they attacked my assistant Hopkins. We're being cornered. Stay hidden, Doctor. We're trying, but there's too many of them. Hurry! But yeah, it, 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 it's like a uh, based on HP Lovecraft's story of the same name. I've, I've read. Some, like, I've already said. I said I've read some of Lovecraft's works, and yeah, they're, they're really good. They're really good stuff. And, and uh, the film re for Reanimator was really, really bloody good. I really, really enjoyed it. I'll definitely watch it again, like, at some point. 
Oh, oh, whoa. I don't really talk much about films. Uh, mostly because I'm a, I'm a very... I'm a very casual watcher of them. I don't really... I don't really think too much about films very much. Ed, you still there? We're barely hanging on. Hopkins is wounded. Are you close? We're moving as fast as we can. Hang in there. Yeah, I, I, I do like films quite a bit. They are pretty great. But, um... I, I guess when I think about... Uh, entertainment mediums... Like, gaming is always, like, the first one for me. It's always gaming for me. I, I mean, the first game I've ever played it was literally the original Doom when I was about four. So no one... So, so, so it's no wonder I, I have a very soft spot for gaming, and it's always the one thing I think about all the bloody time. I like boots as well. Whoa. Ah. What's happening? Kirkwood and Boyles try to run for it. The Reapers got him. Don't move until we get there. Yeah, I, I, quite, I quite like boots as well. Boots are pretty good. I'm more of a writer than a reader, though. Uh, I prefer creating something through the power of, uh, of boots. Ow! Whereas, uh, I do like reading them, I, I, I just I just prefer writing them. Sorry, I'm, I'm extremely dry today, aren't I? But I don't care, you know, sometimes you see me on my days where I'm being a silly wanker, and then days where I just kind of want to, uh, to just sort of chill and just kind of keep it real for once. I kind of, kind of look like a mix of both, it just kind of depends what mood I'm in. And I, I am in a pretty good mood today, I'm just more of, um... I'm just not as en energetic right now because... One, it's fucking hot. Bloody summer, what, what I mean, of, of course. <laughs> and two, I just, I just... Get me! Until I just kind of want to be be a bit more chill right now. I'm also hoping this this will be the last session for Mass Effect 3. Because I'm very certain um, after this DLC, I'd, I'd only have a few missions left and that's it, I'd be done. So, I definitely want to get that out of the way. And and then hopefully just the kind of... Wow. Get to it. And then hopefully just just move on to other things, you know. Because I, I really do lo love love these games. I really really do. It's just doing them back to back really has taken a lot of um. It's taken a surprising amount of energy to do. Let, let let's just pull it pull it bluntly like that. <laughs> let's go up. Well, I can't even turn on this elevator. Elevators online. We're coming up. Please hurry. I think Hopkins is dead. He tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? Reapers were too much. I'm sorry. They didn't make it. Doctor, I need you to come with me. Oh god. Yes, of course. was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any Reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact. Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! What 
they doing? They've activated this. I've never managed anything. Doctor. They've learned to run. The darkness must not be breached. Shepard! Take it out! Got it. You okay? Cortez, we have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle? You run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Also, I was, I was actually uh, more interested in what the, uh, the, the the really tall fucker was that the that the natives were attacking. That kind of interested me. I wonder what, what that big fella was. If you saw it in the paintings. Ow! Ow, 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 ow. Where am I even getting hit from? Oh, right, right, okay, that would explain everything. Uh, that would be very, very handy. Okay, Garrus, you... Oh my goodness! <laughs> you can do that, you can do that. I can do a... Oh, I might actually do a little bit of that, actually. Yeah. I should weaken it a fair bit. I've got quite a bit of shield though, so... I'm in a pretty good position right now. Yay! We took it down. Uh, bam! You can die, please. There we go. Rendezvous with Cortez. You! Hee <laughs> hee! I love throw so much, it's just such a fun power. Okay. Bam! Oh, you come here. Thank you. What the hell is this? Okay, that was a bit weird. Right. You, you silly fucker. I'm awful with these grenades. They, 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 they have a very weird... They have a very weird traje trajectory. That was four shots. You okay? Yeah, Commander. I, I think so. I blacked out. Leviathan took control of you. We cut the connection before you got hurt. Leviathan itself? That's incredible. The Reapers seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first, Doctor, I have some bad news. Anne, please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. Anne, you need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. Sorry. He's... what? Dead? He can't be dead. We met with him, hoping to find out what he knew. Something happened. Something happened? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine, the next... He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Anne? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation to meet you there. What the hell was that noise? 